Welcome to hell! Hey guys, it's Derek. Today's video is going to be really boring. It's about work. I have two things I'm going to put into this video. Um, last month, a co-worker helped me get some footage from work, some stuff I thought that might be a little interesting at least. And then uh, I got a new guitar, so I'm going to show you guys that. And then my amp over there. Stringing. No, 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 no. Not yet. Uh, I'm going to show you the work footage first and get it out of the way. Uh, before we do that, I'm going to tell you a little bit about what's going on. Uh, I'm going to show you what I do, which is I load the train with rail. So I string the rail and then I break the rail. I'm going to start a new pocket and that's, how, that's just how we load it. Now when we break the rail, we have to break it in under three minutes. Uh, I've been doing the same thing for a year, so I, I normally break it in under one minute. Uh, the video I'm going to show you took a little longer, but uh, I'll just let you watch it. I figured I'd show the tools and equipment we use on the east end. Uh, damn it, he's talking. Here. We have all the rail we've loaded so far. No, 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 stop, stop, shh, stop right there, stop, 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 stop. This is a six by nine train. These are obviously six decks. They, each deck holds nine. I believe up here you can see the empty deck right there. Try to push. So, right now we're on pocket eight on deck five. It's gonna get rolled out of here pretty soon because the rail's gonna go pushing by. See it way, way down there. It goes on forever. Anyways, so these are the bars. You saw me take them off the rail. I mean, for comparison, I wear a size 14 shoe. So that's about, they're about two and a half feet, I guess. Or just two feet, whatever. Nah. 
don't know if you can hear it, but they're having to fix a weld. This is our controller we use to move. Watch. Left and right. Up and down. Yeah, that's fun. So that's our controller. Uh, here's our inch and five eighths wrench. That's the 136 pounds per three foot segment. The year and the month. So, back over here. Here's our wrench. Here's the uh, washers and the nut used for the guide here. And my air gun. These nuts are an inch and five eighths, just like the wrench. The wrench is just in case the air gun stops working for some reason. See, the hose likes to break like a motherfucker. So, so this guide, I don't know, I think the guide weighs 35, maybe 40 pounds. And it, this loads up onto the beak here. It's like the guide's guide, I call it the beak. Then here we have the point, which goes on the front of the rail. See the point's about 55 or 60 pounds, maybe 25 kilograms for anyone in Europe that might ever see this video before I die. Ah, that's pretty much it. Real simple. Uh, each of these strings is 1,740 feet. Now, typically we load 1,600, so the whole track itself is a quarter mile. But these are a little longer, 1740s. But, uh, so as soon as this is finished, and it's as soon as they've welded 700 and 1740, ah! Bad at talking. As soon as they've welded, 1,740 feet of rail. We break it. We break it and we start a new pocket. Let's see if we can zoom in. Only have one pocket left on this deck. See that little baby roller? Yeah. Then we clear the rail to let them know that no one's gonna die and get their legs cut off in front of it. So to push. Okay, that was breaking. Next, I'm gonna show you stringing. You came in two seconds too early. Stringing. Don't let me get down there. Hey, hold the rail for one second. <laughs> Holding. No. Ready? Yep. All right, All right clear the Well, that didn't work. Fucking quality check, motherfuckers.
train we just broke right down there they have a pretty good view of the whole place from up here see the crane see the crane way back there that's the weld building but you look at the railway load you see it goes on for pretty much forever that little bit that you see there is the halfway point that's where we tie down the rail to make sure it doesn't slide off during transit. But when you're ready. Yes, beyond this, it goes by for another eighth of a mile. So it's pretty cool. And that was stringing. Stringing. Done with that. Now I get to show you guys my guitar! Ah! And this is my guitar. It's the BC Ritz Draco. Some people say they find the body style distasteful. But I don't really care what other people think. This guitar spoke to me on a Viscaro level. It just suits me. This is the 2007 first run edition. It comes with uh, vertebrae inlays which I think are awesome. Uh, right now it has the stock pickups in there uh, but I just got in the mail Seymour Duncan Black Winter for the bridge. I was thinking about maybe pool rails for the because this is a single coil spot, so I was thinking about maybe getting some cool rails for that. Nah. And over here is my Ignator Armageddon I made reference to in the last video. It's a 120 watts. 120 watts of bone crush and kill your neighbor. Yes. Has lights pop. Bitches love lights. Three channels. Uh, two and three share gain. Or no, they have independent gain, but they share an EQ. They have all these little switches that I don't really know what they do. They don't matter. Comes with your ISP decimator. Master mid-range. Doesn't always want to come on. Because it's on the clean, I guess. Nah, whatever. Yeah. Yes, I like it. I'd probably want to try other amps in the future, of course. But right now, this is my, this is my rig. Nah. Yep. That's a. Uh, that's about it. I'm thinking this is going to be my last filler video for a good long while here. Uh, I gave my two weeks notice last week. So, means this Thursday is going to be my last day with this company. And uh, after that I'm moving to Denver. So, the next video is going to be my new layer. Yes. It's exciting for me because I've been trying to move to Denver for almost three years now finally finally making it happen so uh, exciting things breaking <laughs> why did you stringing <laughs> what are you two breaking stringing <laughs> What's going on? Breaking. Stringing. Breaking.
Streaking! Streaking! Ah! <laughs> Yeah.